What's up, everybody? My reviews are one here again, and uh, the Samsung Galaxy Player was on sale recently, so uh, at Best Buy, so I went out and I picked one up. I picked up the four-inch version because I figured the five-inch version was just a bit too big. Um, it's more like a miniature tablet than it is a, um, a cell phone or MP3 player type device, and I wanted this to be able to be used kind of as an iPod Touch type thing running Android. Um, so I still have all my iPods and everything, but I decided to pick up one of these too so I could do some Android app reviews and look at Android stuff as well on my YouTube channel. And as you can see, it looks a lot like a cell phone as well, so that was another good factor. And I'll be doing a full review of this in Season 2, but I'm actually here to talk about the app Iris available there. So I asked it to tell me a joke, and here's what it tells me for the joke. Uh, tell me joke. How did Burger King get Dairy Queen pregnant? He forgot to wrap his Whopper. Um, I'm telling this out there for um, children like under the age of 10 who possibly are asking their parents' phone stuff if they have this. And the first time I asked it to tell a joke, um, my mom was sitting in the room with me, and I said, you know, tell me a joke. And it says, um, what has... Uh, 75 balls and screws old ladies and it says a bingo game and every time you ask it to tell you a joke it tells you either a perverted joke or a blonde joke so let me ask it um, this question tell me another joke here's your cha cha joke why should blondes not be given coffee breaks it takes too long to retrain them. So there you see that it gives you a blonde joke. Let's ask it one more question, or another joke. Tell me a joke. What animals can you fit in a condom? A cock and a few hairs. Okay, yeah, see, it's very, very perverted. Tell me a joke. Why don't blind men spy diff? Because it scares the shit out of the dog. So, um, this app is great. It's a nice Siri compliment um, for Android users out there who want to have a Siri for their phone. Uh, but just be careful when you have younger children out there that are wanting to use that. And make sure that um, you're careful about what they ask or what you ask it or um, some stuff like that. Because... Um, just using it yesterday, I found out that it has a really perverted sense of humor, and, um, I was shocked at this, thinking that, one, most people out there use the iPhone 4S, um, and let their kids talk to Siri. So a lot of people downloading Iris are gonna let their kids talk to Siri. So I figured, you know, this app is gonna be great, and a full review of this will be coming and I will show you if they fix that in any future updates as well. But I think that that shouldn't be on there because of, you know, younger children who are out there using this app. So, I don't know, leave in the comments section down below what you think. But I really think that because younger children are apt to use things like Iris here, that they should not be able to hide perverted jokes in the uh, base or uh, in the operating system. So, if you have an Android, download Iris and ask it to tell you a joke, and you're going to see that this is not made up, that it really does tell you perverted jokes. So, I was really shocked at this. So, again, just leave a comment down below and tell me what you think. Tell me if you think this is wrong. Tell me if you think that um, this should be removed from the App Store or what. But I, I'm really shocked at that. So, again, just leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think about them hiding perverted jokes in a app.